Well, this one's going to be hard to see, I think. But here's my problem. I was bringing water to the dog, and I noticed right in here, it looks like the grain has split on my hardwood. And now this little section right along here, yeah, maybe you can actually see the bubbling. Yeah, there you go. Right there is where it's bubbling because I believe the grain is just delaminated. Water from the dogs, front door, who knows. If it were a little short board, I would take it out and replace it. But this is one of those really long ones that I put in that goes six miles. So what I think I'm gonna to try to do is cut the bubble out, get it so it pop, the piece pops back in sub flush, epoxy bond it, and then re, uh, re poly. Hear the hollow? It's all lifted up, so I'm going to just try to make a cut right along here and lift the bubble out. Well, here goes nothing. Am I on the screen? Okay, yeah, I'm on screen. Now I've got to decide how far does this run. Get back in my cut. There we go. I think that will work. See, just popped up hollow. Well, that came out a lot better than I expected. Here's the piece to glue back in. And, uh, what came out is actually pretty nice now. This should be repairable. I'm gonna sand this piece up a little to clean up the faces. And I'm going to uh, scrape this down a little and then see about putting it back in with some epoxy.
Well, it's had an hour or so. Let's see what it looks like. Well, that's what it looks like. Dusty back up. Okay. And this is one edge. That's the other. When it's urethane in, you won't notice it. That's a crack. Hopefully I'll get enough urethane in at this time to level it out. Yeah, I think that's hard enough. That's what it looks like after the first coat of your thing. It's right there. Okay, well that's the finished product right there. Bring you in close so you can see it. But it's right here where I cut out. If you look real close, you can see the knife line here. This is where it was already broken free and lifting, all this side. So all I did was cut down on the air bubble, epoxy it in. Urethane's a little light there. Maybe tonight I'll give it another spot touch. But it came out pretty good. Overall, not bad at all. Let me turn the big light on and see if that helps. But again, it's a real nice, solid fix.